Okay, hello. So you might have heard of the Huawei versus Technoblade shenanigans, but you might ask yourself, who in the hell is Huawei? Okay, so first of all, um, some people call him the god of PvP. Some people call him better than Technoblade. Some people call him the next Technoblade. But personally, I do not think this is true. I it, it just depends on other people's opinions, but. This has been this um, beef or stuff has been actually going on for quite some time now. Um, the Huawei versus Technoblade and Technoblade actually made a video about this five years ago. I'm gonna put a um, screenshot of, of that right here, but but um it but um it's not actually a a real fight between Huawei and Technoblade. It's just him like making a Hunger Games stuff. I don't know shenanigans, memeing. I don't know, but. They're both good in their own main games. Like for example, um, Huawei may, Hu Huawei is um, good in UHC. Meanwhile, um, Technoblade is good at Bed Wars and Sky Wars. But I don't really know if um, Huawei has ever um, played Sky Wars or Sky Wars. I mean Sky Wars or Bed Wars. But let's hope he played Sky Wars or Bed Wars. But Technoblade has a is um. It's almost the PvP god in Sky Wars and Bed Wars. Some people, I mean, some people e even got toxic and accusate him for some reason. I mean, toxic people. You, 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 you gotta expect that they're gonna be toxic. Like, okay, but, but they're both good in their own main games. Like, for example, Technoblade is good at Sky Wars and Bed Wars. Meanwhile, Huawei is good at Duels and UHC. Now. Who would actually win in in some in some of these games, Technoblade or Huawei? First, we'll be going on to the Bed Wars. Who would win in Bed Wars, Huawei or Technoblade? Now, it can be a it can be an obvious um um reason because Technoblade has dominated Bed Wars for uh, quite some time now. He and he's actually made a win streak of like one one thousand and four hundred plus. I don't know. And he's and he's set um like two or three records on bed wars, like he's got the most final kills. I I, I don't know most most um the highest win he has the highest win streak. I don't know maybe I forgot but but I don't really know if Huawei has ever played bed wars or has made any records that can be like that can be astonishing or established or get a glimpse or or just go blowing out in the in the in the in the in the internet sorry if i stuttered there anyways um but who but moving on who would win in sky wars now again this is gonna be an obvious up i mean this is gonna be an obvious um option it might be technoblade it might be huawei but it it will be obvious it's gonna be technoblade because he's because technoblade has developed the many many um tactics in sky wars like in bridging or rushing or enchanting or just pretty much strategizing in general now huawei um i, I don't really know if he's ever played sky wars but let's hope he played sky wars because if he ever fights technoblade in one of these games he's 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 most likely to like um get a disadvantage if he if he doesn't have any experience on these two games like bed wars and sky wars but technoblade would most likely to win in sky wars or bed wars because he has more experience than huawei himself now 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 if if you're a um huawei fan and you're watching this video please don't get toxic okay i do not mean any hate towards these two or to any to, or to anyone in in this video okay but who would win in uhc now 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 this might be an obvious option i mean opinion or um obvious answer it's it might be huawei it might be technoblade i mean technoblade i, I, I don't think he's ever played huawei i mean I don't think Technoblade has made um, any UHC records or he's or even played UHC that much. I mean, I mean, commonly he plays Bed Wars and Sky Wars, but currently, right now, he's only streaming on the Dream SMP, which which is which he I, I don't really know. Okay, but but Huawei would most likely to win in UHC. Now you might wonder why I'm saying this. That, that Huawei is gonna win most likely in UHC than in 
than Technoblade. Now, now the reason I'm saying Huawei would win in UHC is because Huawei has more experience in UHC and uh, made records. I think I. I think I, I I don't really know, but I but I do think he's made some records in UHC somehow, or probably like um went popular on UHC somehow. But I do think that Huawei would win um um in UHC if he ever fights Technoblade in a one v one match in UHC. Okay, um I I I, I l listen. I'm pretty sure you had a stroke trying to understand me. Okay, but. I'm really sorry, okay? But, moving on to their history. Now, Technoblade has made um, some great records in the past, like the win streaks, kill streaks, um, what else? The the tournaments, MCCs, um, MC Mondays, Hunger Games, or just basically on any on any of his tournaments, he's dominated. He's dominated every single one of his tournaments. I don't... But I don't really know if he's really dominated many of his tournaments. He lost some of um, his tournaments. He won. But mostly I think he won some of his tournaments. I think. But meanwhile, um, Huawei. Um, I don't really know if he's made um, good a a any good records. I don't really know. But but, um, but, but um, I don't but. I don't really think that Huawei has made any good records at, at all because I don't even watch him that much but I do think he's pretty good but right now Huawei is just posting Osu stuffs, Osu clickbait videos <laughs> I, I'm I, I'm kidding okay but but yes he's just making Osu, Osu videos, Valorant videos, um, Genshin Impact videos um, I think he has I, I, but I don't think he hasn't um, made any mi Minecraft related content recently, but meanwhile Technoblade, he's currently um, retired retired from 1.8 PvP and, and is now continuing on 1.16 PvP and he's just streaming on the Dream SMP and nothing else, but hopefully he streams on Bedwars or Skywars someday, but Yes, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe since I'm trying to hit 1k by the end of the year. Anyways, see ya.